Ah, uh, Victor Echo 3. I come back with a call sign again, please, sir. Yeah, good afternoon, Jim. It's uh, Victor Echo 3, Papa, Charlie, Papa, Rob in uh, Inver here in Ontario. Kyoto. Uh, roger, Roger. Uh, up towards Ontario, is that a Roger? Uh, yep, Kyoto, we are on the shores of uh, Lake Huron. Uh, Kyoto, we are on the shores of uh, Lake Huron, uh, about uh, two and a half hours northwest of the city of Toronto. We've talked uh, quite a few times. I'm usually checking in from the mobile, but I'm at home today, Kyoto. Uh, roger, Roger there. Uh, the, the station checking in. The station, uh, stand by, please. Uh, this is uh, KC9 VKV, and this is the QSO Vlog Network. Uh, we'll uh, be uh, up in Canada for just a little while, so uh, stand by. Uh, Canada, what was the name again, please? So, uh, stand by. Uh, Canada, what was the name again, please? Uh, yeah, the name here is Rob Roger Oscar Baker, QSO. Roger, Rob. A beautiful sound. Uh, uh, what radio? A beautiful sound. Uh, uh, what radio? I'm running a Kenwood uh, TS850, and I recently uh, refurbished my old uh, uh, D104 desk mic. I took the guts out of it and replaced it with a Mucktret uh, condenser uh, cartridge in the head kissel. Ah, yes. <laughs> a beautiful, a great decision, a wise decision also, Roger. A great decision, a wise decision also, Roger. Yeah, QSL, so well, the old uh, crystal mic uh, wasn't working uh, properly, and uh, the, the amplifier uh, uh, portion of it uh, wasn't either, so I just decided uh, I'll break, breathe some life back into it by putting the uh, Electret uh, cartridge in the head, and uh, it seems to uh, be getting some uh, some good audio uh, checks uh, back from other uh, people. Just uh, wanted to check in with the uh, with the king of uh, audio checks and uh, see how it uh, sounded down your way, QSL. So. Uh, Rod, uh, beautiful sound. Now, did you have DC on your uh, mic from that radio? DC on your uh, mic from that radio? Uh, there is DC available from the radio, but uh, I use the 9-volt battery uh, that was in the base uh, for, for powering the uh, the carriage. Uh, the radio here is a Kenwood uh, TS850 QSL. Uh, Roger. And uh, so uh, I, I take it that that uh, D104 was a powered microphone. Is that a Roger? That uh, D104 was a powered microphone. Is that a Roger? Uh, yeah, QSL. Yeah, it was the TUG8 stand, so it had the preamp built into the base. Uh, Roger. And you're running through the uh, using the preamp with your Electret cartridge. The uh, using the preamp with your Electret cartridge. Uh, no, the Electret cartridge is uh, directly uh, into the radio. No, nothing in between. Ah, very good, very good. Well, sounds beautiful. Uh, what uh, kind of EQ did you uh, have to crank in, or did you? What kind of EQ did you uh, have to crank in, or did you? Well, there's no EQ on this radio. It's uh, uh, I've got uh, a processor and a mic gain. That's the only thing. Uh, I've got the processor engaged and set about three, and the mic gain uh, is also set uh, between three and four. ALC bouncing up uh, into the uh, mid to uh, two thirds and three quarter scale QSO. Oh, Roger. Well, I mean, you couldn't have gotten a better curve if you had a 10 band EQ uh, shaping it into the radio, Roger. EQ uh, shaping it into the radio, Roger. The yeah, IQS speed with the right uh, with the right signal, I guess. But uh, this is a wide range uh, uh, carriage. I think it covered uh, from 10 uh, 10 hertz up to uh, uh, up to uh, to uh, uh, up to uh, 50 kilohertz or something like that. So pretty broad range uh, cartridge gizmo. Uh, roger that. Roger that. Yeah. Uh, th sometimes uh, those uh, electric cartridges can uh, reproduce uh, frequencies down in the lower ebbs that uh, one might want to just as soon uh, uh, forget. I have a, a CRISPR, a, um, uh, a passive CRISPR that I use uh, quite often on the electric microphone. And this has to do with, um, you know, uh, phono... Um, uh, phono plugs, they have a, a plastic shield, a plastic body that goes over the phono plug. Well, I take that plastic body off, and now I've got me a, a you know, a, a jobber that I can take a razor blade, and I can cut it uh, about uh, at the two-thirds point. So I have this uh, cylinder that is exactly the size of the electret cartridge. So I can put the electret cartridge uh, inside that cylinder and it uh, sticks out in front of the microphone about, uh, oh, no, not quite a half an inch. Uh, you know, maybe uh, a quarter, or a little bit more. And, and what that does, it tailors the audio going into the electret uh, uh, pickup and it boosts the uh, top end. Maybe uh, you might be a plus uh, six or seven dB at uh, 10 KC with that CRISPR on, Roger. Uh, 10 KC 
see with a CRISPR on. Roger. Uh, yeah, QSO, yeah, I can see how that would work. It uh, becomes a, a bit of a passive filter uh, uh, and uh, rejects the, uh, uh, the, longer, um, the longer wavelength of, of the lower uh, frequency QSO. Roger, well, I'm glad to know what I was doing, because <laughs> uh, uh, you're listening to one right now. This is uh, Electret uh, cartridge with uh, that uh, CRISPR on it. Roger, Roger. That uh, CRISPR on it. Roger, Roger. Yep, yes, out. Well, hearing me okay, and that the audio sounds good, and uh, I don't want to hold you up too long, because I know you probably got lots of guys that are lining up to, uh, to have a chat with you, so I do appreciate uh, your time again this afternoon. And I uh, look forward to uh, listening to uh, the recording on YouTube uh, in the next couple of days. So 7-3, uh, uh, Jim, for the afternoon, and uh, thank you very much uh, for doing what you do. Uh, KC9, VKB, V3, PCP. Roger, roger, Rob. And also, uh, we first, well, second uh, Friday that we've been using our source uh, indicator on screen so folks can keep track of uh, my uh, comings and goings on my sixth position rotary input selector. I've been bouncing around between the uh, 7300, the uh, FT990, and uh, some of the uh, SDRs. So if uh, you want to hear what your radio sounds like under multiple situations, uh, if you go to YouTube uh, and uh, do a call letter search for KC9 VKV, and uh, then look for uh, Mike Repair Check uh, 1320. Uh, that is today's date, 1320 Mike Repair Check on the uh, I call it a search. Uh, that will uh, bring up uh, this uh, air check today, and uh, you'll be able to uh, check out uh, the comings and goings on our uh, remote uh, indicator. Roger. Oh, yeah, QSL, yeah. I can uh, tell when you're using a... Uh an SDR receiver because there's a slight delay in, uh, in you coming back to me and I know from uh, listening to previous uh, air checks that uh, uh, the, the Milford PA SDR is typically what you listen to me uh, through when I'm mobile at least anyway and uh, when I'm mobile at least anyway and uh, delay uh, on it so uh, anyway thank you very much again and, uh, I'll, let you get, and uh, I'll let you get back to the other stations there KC9 VKV V3 PCP Roger, Roger, Rob. Uh, Rochester was doing uh, the best uh, job today, and uh, Arlington was doing uh, fairly well. Atlanta was uh, coming and going, and Milford wasn't, uh, uh, didn't seem to be up around where it normally is. But anyway, uh, <laughs> uh, three's up that way, sir. Stay warm, and we'll uh, catch you next Friday if you get a chance. Drop by. Uh, this is KC9 VKV, and this is the Friday afternoon QSO Vlog Network. If you've got a radio you want to check out, give me a shout. 